Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3 Into the Future. I'm Landros, and of course, they're still here sleeping. Let's see, got them going ahead and influence their dreams. Call your best friend. The Tendrigar game. Um, all that works for me. Alright, so let's see. They're fine. Um, yeah, I answered all the questions. Let's take a look. Bishop, buddy, you're good. <laughs> Go ahead. Um, you can give yourself a tune up. Oh, you're already doing that. So I guess I don't have to actually tell you to do anything. What about the kid? Um, he's fine. He's actually not bad at all. So really, I don't have much to worry about. Um, it's kind of one of those things that I'm really just waiting on Luke to get up. He's going to be sleeping for a while. Meredith, uh, let's see. You don't go to work for a while. I think you do work today. No, this is festival day, isn't it? And I believe I do have a festival in town. I think. Let's just go double check. <laughs> I'm just going to make sure. Man, it's some ugly water. <laughs> it's hideous. Um, no, I don't, because I believe this is where I put it. Normally, there's a lot right here, and I think this is where I put the festival. Maybe, maybe not. Well, it's obviously not here, because I would have seen it. But, yeah, there's only, like, one big 64 by 64 lot. Uh, it's not that far up. Maybe it's down here. I don't know. I didn't put it in. So we don't need it. It's not that big of a deal. We can actually use um, the one back in Moonlight Falls whenever we go back. Not sure when we're going back, but I am planning on it. All right, so you guys are fine. Bishop, I'm sure I need to be working on something for you. Yeah, you got abducted, but you can't get pregnant, so you really don't have to worry about anything. Um, I could have you working on upgrading things, but... Do you have that? I don't know if you have that ability. No, you don't. So there's nothing I can do. Uh, you can clean the house. No, not really. There's nothing for you to clean. It's kind of sad, but I have nothing for you to do. Um, I'm really stuck. I'm going to speed him up because apparently there's nothing I can do. Uh, when he gets up, I am going to have him, first of all, let's take care of what he needs. And what he needs first will, of course, be see probably don't need this as much but we're going to do it anyway go ahead and do oh you want to improve it and then you want to actually all right we'll just wait and see what you do <laughs> okay I'll, i won't worry about it meredith what did you do oh you're up why don't we go ahead and oh <laughs> i was gonna say what are you doing all right you go ahead and can bring down your whatchamacallit uh where is the kitchen I swear this house. I don't know it. Um, I'm so used to that other one. I play that other one all the time. Let's see, is this still good? Yeah, I don't think this stuff ever goes bad. So you can go ahead and come on down, grab a plate. Um, you got plenty of time before you have to go to work, so we're not too concerned about any of this. And did you do everything you had to do here? I think you did. You upgraded this completely to its capacity or its uh, potential. And what's downstairs? car okay <laughs> there's a car and a fountain and ugly water <laughs> really ugly water um yeah there's really not much here not much at all okay now i guess i should have you working on something for your astronomy career but i don't know what you need uh right now it's just your mood and i can't really mess that up i don't think i can i might be able to um when you get done with this, I'm gonna let you go ahead and do your. Let's see, you go ahead and up, improve that one as well. Hello, horse. <laughs> How you doing? Uh, there's nothing here in the mail we have to worry about. Let's see, the kid is getting ready to get upset. So, Bishop, why don't you come on up and give him a bath? Actually, let's just change him. And then we have to take care of food and everything else. Man. <laughs> All right. Can you age up today? Let's snuggle with him. Let's see. Change his diaper which you're not going to really need to do because you just did it. You just cleaned him. Uh, play with him, snuggle, and then put him back. <laughs> All right, so you're good. All right, Luke, finally, get yourself up. Um, you are kind of hungry, so instead of improving this thing, let's just go ahead and just use it, and then I'm going to let you come on down and grab some food. All right, go ahead and grab that plate. And then I'm going to get you back upstairs working because whatever we were doing, I forgot. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, we had a lot of stuff that we had gotten. Um, no, not really. Uh, one, two. 
two, three, four. I, oh, the crawly ones are the ones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We're missing one. Mm. Too bad. <laughs> You're going to go ahead and actually create nanites. I don't know what I just asked you to create. I really don't. Let's just go ahead and create. Um, are these the big ones? No, those can't be the big ones, can they? They're cheap. All right, so these are the big ones. All right, so there's only really two pages. All right, so let's start with here. And we'll just work on the big ones today. Hopefully you can get them all. Um, like I said, we probably ought to go home and actually see what we've got set up. I'm sure we have everything we need right there at the house, and it would be fine. All right, when we get this done, I'm going to create a place for him maybe in his garage or maybe um, I don't know we'll find a place for him somewhere where we can put all these nanites out and we'll see what we need and what we're missing because it's too hard for me to tell at this point this house is just like it's too big for just the amount of people we got that's what it is I mean it's not a bad house it's just way too big and the kid is good again <laughs> alright so you're fine and who changed this back um change this room let's give him we had that let's go with the beach there we go all right so Luke if you're set um, maybe he'll come down and clean it gives him a job <laughs> all right, go down and do your job yep nope he's gonna go sit you're gonna relax because you did so much work um, <laughs> you when you finish this one up um, go ahead and take care of your bladder Oh, can you upgrade it? Oh, yeah, you can upgrade that. Make sure we don't have anything breaking down on us because um, <laughs> that would not be good. And then we'll go ahead and take care of, hopefully you're getting your power cleanse thing done, and that'll be good too. All right, Luke. It didn't take you long to get up here, so I'm pretty impressed. Yeah, I'm ready to go back to uh, <laughs> regular future. This ugly, first it was green, now it's yellow. It's just ugly colors um, really doesn't look good at all okay it doesn't look so bad from here but you know you just gotta get up and look at it that's just nasty mm. wouldn't want to be out in it okay so you go ahead and finish up um, I hope we're getting everything done what kind of books are in here oh my are you kidding me we have all the books <laughs> I had no idea so this Oh, no, we don't. All right, so we have a few. I was thinking it was all the other ones. Ah, great. What a way to tease. Um, it's just like the regular bookcases. I just was falling for that uh, cooking one and everything. All right, so you made one of them. That's good. Um, how'd you do? Did you, fin you finished it, didn't you? Yeah, do your power cleanse, and then we'll get you upstairs to do the one in the bedroom. Hopefully. Um... What time do you work? 8 o'clock in the morning? Okay. I didn't know what time you were at. Um, let's go ahead and go back up here and tell you to do the same thing. Wait, this is not the bedroom. Uh, the bedroom's up here. See, like I said, it's just way too big for this many people. Now, once we have kids and everything, yeah, then it's different. But for right now, not so much. Love having a witch. This is normally if you have a sim that has to do it with a handiness skill, it takes forever. This no big deal I should have actually gotten you magic hands by now but I don't think I gave you the well you got points but not enough so let's see now what's the difference of this I think it's just you get a moodlet <laughs> maybe that's it I don't know or maybe it goes faster I can't really remember but you did it you got it upgraded and it looks good to me alright Luke back with you your last one was, let's see, prismatic. Go ahead and create something else. Um, thermo. Please don't mess any of these up. Condenser. And torque. Okay, now if you don't mess them up, you should be good. Alright, looks like you got those two. Bishop. <laughs> Still relaxing. Uh, don't break sweat, buddy. <laughs> don't do it. And our kid is fine. Doesn't really need anything. Yeah, I'm just kind of like, all right, what do I do? Um, I guess I could have a party or something, invite people over, but 
we don't know anybody. That's <laughs> a sad thing. We've been here all this time. Don't know a single person, really. We know Emmett and one other robot. <laughs> That's it. Uh, I have failed my family. So I have failed them because the game keeps crashing. All the game files have to actually get changed over. Now look at this guy. That is just one ugly sky. What does it look like back in the town? Oh, we can't see it. Okay. All right. Yeah, that doesn't look good. Now, apparently, we can go over and we can go rummaging and do the dumpster diving with the big uh, trash piles. There's more to do. Um, I don't do a whole lot of it. I think now, once we actually go back, we should be able to actually turn them back um, whenever we want. I think one of us gets something. We get some kind of, like, device that allows you to flip um, the futures back and forth. And that's good. I, I wouldn't mind doing that, but... I can see I'm probably not going to be playing in this one very much just because it is bad. Now, you're supposed to hear all these meteors crashing and everything. I don't hear any. I don't see any. So I'm kind of curious as to where they are. Um, it would be nice because I thought that was going to happen. Maybe it's just random. Maybe it just doesn't happen every day. <clears throat> all right. Once you're done with this, you've designed... I think you've actually designed every trait... you every trait chip you can design, can't you? So I think you're maxed. Let's go take a look. Bot building, um, let's see. Trait chips created, 19, okay, discovered is 21. I think that's it. Um, chip in by discovering 21 different trait chips. Okay, so we know all the trait chips. We haven't done all the nanites. You've only made 28, and you're supposed to make 200. It's going to take a while. All right. Yeah, I think he's got them all. So hopefully we got some stuff we can make them. Oh. And we need to just get this plumbot started so we can actually sell something. This is not going to be how we end today, I hope. We're going to actually try our best. Now, he should be able to create this plumbot, and um, it should be automatically level 10 or pretty close. So I think what we will do is we'll just go ahead and... We'll start one up for 250 and see what we can come up with. You, I'm so glad you're preoccupied. You have something to do. You still want to go back to the present. I know it. Um, I'm sure there's a lot more for us to do in the present right now, but I'd like to go back to the present just so we can change this future. <laughs> I really would. Just to get this thing back to normal. All right, so looking pretty good. Everything's fine. I don't really have any other things I can do. I'm just kind of stuck. Now, I should actually have her learning bot building as well. But I don't know why. She really has no purpose doing it. I mean, unless she really wants to. It doesn't matter. She wants to have a kid. And she wants to learn how to cook. You want to improve laser Rhythmicon. Do we have one? Hang on. Don't go relaxing. You can go play. Go ahead and play that and see if you can improve the skill. And then that way, at least, maybe you get something done that you want. And how are your needs? Fine. All right, Luke. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> okay, keep it soft and, and quiet. I don't have to hear it. Uh, you know, you just had to go that one step, didn't you? Um, we'll have to take you to a park and leave you. Um, that just sounds awful, but it's true. All right, Luke, uh, you're almost done. We're going to get you... We need to actually make traits for Bishop. Um, Uh-oh, Bishop. Step up, buddy. Come on, it's your time. Let's go over here and let's give him a bottle and a snuggle. Oh, don't wake him up. Uh, it's too late now. <laughs> you woke him up. Uh, let's go ahead and change him. What's wrong with him? Oh, he's just needing social. All right, we'll go ahead change him again. Let's see, snuggle again, play with him, and he should be fine. See, if you get there faster, buddy, we wouldn't have to hear that screaming. Uh, we'll leave you in a park. <laughs> That's awful to say, but uh, we're coming. It was my own fault I woke you up. I should have just waited. All right, let's go ahead and put you back in the crib when you're done. All right, Meredith got up to level two, so she actually got that wish taken care of. What else do you want? Um, attend the planetarium show. All right, we'll go. See, want to go? No, he's like, I don't care. Um, 
He does need to take care of his needs, but we don't have a bathroom up here, do we? Why didn't I put one? Mm, it's not like I can't afford it. I can make one real quick. All right. Let's do that. Let's get you a bathroom so you don't have to go up and down stairs all the time. And this one will be the one. Let's see. Can it fit right there? There we go. Yeah, that's 5,000 smallings well spent. Um, you want a woohoo in it. Of course, as soon as I buy you something, you want to have a <laughs> woohoo in it. That's just typical Sims. All right. I'm serious. <laughs> You're going to have to tone that down. I don't know how to do it, but... I wish there was a way you could just kind of mute certain objects in the game. It would be kind of nice. All right, did you make it? Yes, you did. I hear the baby crying, but I'm ignoring it. <laughs> I really am. I just don't want to deal with that. Not right now. All right, so your last one to make, and then hopefully we should have all of them. Yeah, we got lots of different ones. Um, I'm probably missing something major, and I don't know what it is. I'll figure it out when I actually try to go make something. Um... I guess we should have actually looked at the trait chips and said this is what we want to make and just started creating what we needed. Oh man, you're not friends with Bexley? Oh, that's Bishop. <laughs> Bishop doesn't care. So like, I don't care if I'm friends with anybody or not. I'm just here to do my job. That's sad, but it's true. He doesn't have any emotion chips or anything like that, so he doesn't matter. What do you want to do? Equip a friendly functions trait chip? Well, all right. It looks like you want to have that. All right. Now, we should be going into create a bot in just a moment, and then we'll actually create a new one. This one is one to sell, so I'm not going to put a whole lot of emphasis on it. It's just going to be real quick. Just whatever comes up, we'll try to work with it. Don't get attached to it, so we can just take it in and sell it. All right. Any time now would be good. You don't have to actually... Uh, you're going to waste my entire LP time, aren't you? <laughs> That's just typical. Come on. There we go. All right. <laughs> it's kind of kind of funny looking. All right. Let's take a look at what name you're going to get. Is it Zenge? <laughs> okay, Zenge. And Zenge, looks like you are male. All right. That's Zenge. All right. I'm going to leave you just like you are. And let's see what we can do for you. And we will actually make a little bit of money off of this. Um, I don't think he has any trait chips in here, but if he does, we'll use them. No, he doesn't have any. Probably has some in that chest that's at home. <laughs> I bet he does. All right, so let's go ahead and make a trait chip. Um, I don't want to design, I want to create. Let's see what you want to make. And I need to check out Zenge and see what he's at. Um, the more of these you actually get, the better it's going to be. Hollow projector. Alright, let's get him hollow projector. What does efficient do? And that, that's the one I want for bishop. Yeah, I want that one for bishop, so I really don't want to actually... Mm, Alright, I want to lose all my stuff for that. So, sorry buddy, <laughs> we're going to get you in just a minute. So create... I need to do at least maybe three or four for him. All right, what are you guys going to do? Scan him. Okay, scan him real quick. Let's see what he looks like. Oh, average quality. Uh, we're going to be stuck with Zinge for a while. Sorry. Bishop, come on over here, and you can actually help out. Go ahead and give him a tune-up. Let's do it a couple of times. All right, let's see what you can do. Help us out. At least this gives you another function, so... Uh, don't mess it up. Don't mess him up. Of course, his bot building's not very high, so he's not going to really help, but Luke will be the one who will actually do well. Alright, Luke. <clears throat> I want limitless learning so he can actually learn new things. There we go. We got a trait chip. Alright, moving on back down. Um, okay, see, hollow projector. I can't do it anymore. That's why I figured. Alright, solar powered. Uh, Bishop has already got that, so we'll give that one to him, too. Right now, this thing is not going to do very well for us. Okay. Zinge, <laughs> you were supposed to come out a little bit better than that. I don't know. I mean, he is a level 10 bot builder, isn't he? He is, I believe. Yeah. 
Well, of course, we didn't do it by the real way. We did it by books, so it makes a big difference. The more you practice, the better it's going to be, and the more likely it's going to come out being very high quality. All right, are you guys done? Oh, no. Okay. Keep working on him. <laughs> All right. And let's see. You're fine. Your needs, you're good. All right, so we got solar power done. What else are you going to get? Um, let's see. Limitless learning I can't do. I need medium processors. Okay, we'll just have to take some of these nanites apart, see what we can get. Um, give him off the drone. It's whatever we got. Now, you can always buy the trait chips, actually, in the bot center, so we could do that, too. Um, put them in and see what we get. Uh, it's not like we're really hurting for money, so I don't really need to worry about any of that. Let's see, you're fine, but you do need to go to bed. Nah, 2.25. What time do you work? Yeah, I would say so. Stop playing. All right, get up here and just take care of needs. Actually, you're already here. Poor thing. Go ahead and use it. Do your power cleanse. And let's see. Cast your charm. Hunger. And then go to bed. And I'm going to have you dream about your job. So, all right. Luke, I'm just messing with you. I'm not even bothering with your wife. Poor thing. And you're going to actually go to the bathroom too in just a minute. Let's see. All right. What did I just do? I did office drone. Um, Robo Nanny. All right. We'll do Robo Nanny. Before you know it, we'll get this done. Now, Zinj, did you move up at all with what Bishop's doing? No. <laughs> not at all. And Luke's not going to have enough energy. Well, he could do it for a while. <clears throat> he could. There's no way to actually do it on um, automatic. You just have to just keep messing with him. So we'll be stuck with this with this guy for a little while. <laughs> That's quite all right. Are you done? At least you got this thing upgraded. That was something good for today. I was kind of hoping we get something finished. That's why I kind of wish I had not gotten you a job. Um, I was getting it to you because I had nothing for you to do. But, you know, there's really no point. I mean, it's not like you guys need it. And we're going to go to the planetarium, but maybe not tonight. All right, go in there. What do you want? Um, fear of humans is a three. Let's go with whatever. And... That should be enough. And then what I think I'll do is I'll just go ahead. We'll have to interrupt interrupt him in just a minute. All right, she should be telling us what she wants in just a minute. For the wishes, hopefully it's actually good. Um, all right. Zenj, come on. <laughs> Give it up. Still average. All right, you're going to dream about career. There you go. And then we're going to go ahead and influence your dream. Promoted to king. <laughs> Dramatically fire somebody. All right. There you go. All right. As long as you stay in the green, you're fine. Luke, finish up. Go to the bathroom. And then how much does he have to do? Oh, he's almost done. Explain your function. <laughs> nah. All right. You'll adjust his traits. And then you can tune him up, too. Um... All right. Maybe he'll go better because you've got the skill. I don't think he really got much from Bishop. No, <laughs> not much at all. Uh, I don't want to put fear of humans in him, but he'll pee all over my house. <laughs> That's the bad thing. All right, Bishop, it's time for you to step back, buddy. Go over here and do a recharge. Looks trying to work. Ah. Uh, we could always try making another one and see if it comes out any better, but, I mean, sometimes it's random. But, yeah, that's all right. We'll work on it. It just gives us something for him to focus on and get him up there. Okay. Make him efficient. No, that was for, for um, the bishop. Give him Handybot, Office Drone, Robonani, Solar Powered. Okay. All right. Now, tune him up. And do a good job. <laughs> make sure he, make sure he gets better. Uh, does that make a difference? 
Okay, what was that menu bar or that power? Was that um? Uh, maybe tune up is a hidden skill. I don't know. I, it could be. <laughs> There's all kinds of things it could be. All right, go ahead and tune up again. Oh, not you. All right. Do it again. And again. Since that didn't take too long, let's go ahead and just make sure he does it. See, he's getting some kind of skill bar for that. I don't know if it's... It can't be charisma because I think he mastered charisma, didn't he? No, he didn't. All right, so maybe that's what it is. All right. All right, so his quality was upgraded to decent. Okay. See, that's what I'm looking for. I think Bishop just kind of wasted his time because he didn't have the skill. Yep, that was charisma. That's what we're working on. I wondered. I figured there was had to be something for that. Okay. Tune up. Keep going. <laughs> All right. This kid, is he upset? Oh, man. Bishop, go down here and take care of this kid. Um, come on over here, and let's see. He needs everything. He's aging up today, thank goodness. All right, let's go ahead and give him a bottle and snuggle. You know, kid... We gave you nice pictures of the ocean or the beach, and you're still upset. All right, play with him and snuggle. That should take care of him. All right, Meredith, you got to go. Are you up yet? No. But, you know, your needs are fine, so you shouldn't have any problems. It should not be a big issue for you. This poor guy is the one that's going to be upset. Um, we got nothing yet. I don't know how many times he's going to have to do this, but since he's at a level 5, that's not bad, but, you know, we'll get better. And there is a, um, something about the tune-ups. I forgot. I was going to look over the, um, skills. Let's go over and look. Uh, what does it say about tune-ups? Earn 5,000 performing tune-ups. You have to do that from other people. Um, okay. Alright, so, nothing I can worry about now. Now, I need to get him home, get him down to eat, because I forgot he's a werewolf. He'll, he'll be all nasty in just a little bit and start turning into a wolf, and then I can't do anything. All right, let's get you. Is that food still good? Yeah, that food never goes bad. I love it. <laughs> I really do. All right, how do we do? Nothing changed. Yeah, I don't know how long it's gonna take. It's, it may take a while. It's Derek's birthday. No, <laughs> I don't want Derek's birthday to happen. Okay, so we got to change that. Um, don't we have potions or know how to make potions or something like that? Dreams of insane productivity, have Meredith feeling ready to take on the world, or work performance has never been better. Well, you better enjoy it because you got to go now. They're waiting for you. Get up and go. What are you going to wear? Because I'm curious. Uh, that's what you're going to wear. <laughs> All right, I like it. Okay, so we got him up to next gen. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Is that level six? It should be. Oh, no, it bumped. All right, so we got up to level nine. Oh, cool. So actually, it can jump that high. I like that. All right, so you may actually sell this thing today after, after all. I'm not sure. Um, Luke has become a master at tuning plumb bots. His tune-ups will provide a longer-lasting effect. Okay. And he's now at future tech, so we are fine. All right, you can stop. So you should be, yep, you are fully, fully done. We'll take you in, and we will get you on the chopping block so you can be sold. Um, let's see, is he tired? He is, but he'll be all right. Uh, we'll go ahead, and let's do this. Let's go to the Plumbot Station Shop Emporium, and let's go ahead and visit this with Zinj. It'll be after you eat. Sorry, Zinj. You know, we did what we could for you. And we are going to put that Fury of Humans back in you, too. Just so we have one more trait for you. And make the most we can out of you. Because I'd like to get him at least off of level 1. <laughs> it would be nice. And then, uh, I don't see potions in here, but that doesn't mean that we don't have that ability. Somebody knows it. Um, let's see, you've got science. Oh, no, you don't have logic, so there's no way... Oh, no. You don't have logic? I think we had Fountain of Youth potions. That's what we had. If that's the case, we gotta go home. <laughs> we gotta go home. Or she can make them, but she doesn't have the ingredients for it. So that's not good. That's not good at all. Uh, 
I don't think I brought them with us either. I can look. Let's just see if I brought anything with us from home. No, I did not bring them anything. It's all right. He can age up, but we can always roll him back down. Ah, that kid. All right, <laughs> kid, don't do this to me. Okay, you should be getting this finished. And then in order to do um, the Fountain of Youth, I can't remember what it is. I have to go look and see. I gotta go look and see what it is. Now, if he gets a tattoo, that'll roll him, at, him back down, but didn't she... Wait a minute. It's... Oh, it's not Luke's. It's Derek's. <laughs> All right, guys. I'm sitting here thinking it's his. Oh, it's his kid. It's fine. You can age up whenever you want. Ah, so I lost a whole few minutes because I just did not pay attention. I gotta go to bed. It's, time. it's too late. Uh all right, come on, let's go ahead, because I want to see how much this um, plumb bot's going to get us. We don't have to sell for much, just to actually, yeah, we only need 75. So we'll bump up probably a few levels, and um, that should be fine. Why are you cleaning up? And how do you clean up? Oh, you just put it in that thing, don't you? I like it. All right, I like it quite a bit. Now, I noticed, and you guys probably noticed too, that <laughs> the episodes were coming out way too dark. And... Um, it was a glitch. It was like when I would go into regular my regular screen, like uh, windowed mode, it was fine. It looked just like this. It was no big deal. But when I would go into full screen, it would just be darker. And I got so frustrated. I kept changing my monitor. And, I mean, I've still changed it. I've got it all so messed up that I'm trying to actually figure out what the right levels are. If you guys have that issue, let me tell you, it's a real simple fix. Um, it's called go back. Oh, wait. No, don't bring the kid. All right, fine. Bring the kid. <laughs> we'll take him back. Um Anyway, it's called uh, the compatibility issue, so you just have to change it and turn off um, Windows compatibility, and then your uh, display will go back to normal. It was frustrating. I kept thinking, why is my screen getting so dark? And that's what it was. It's a very strange issue. All right, before you do this, make sure that this guy has nothing in his inventory, and um, it would make a big difference. All right, where are you at? Luke is going to go ahead and he's going to adjust your traits one more time. That poor kid. I can't believe we brought the kid. Well, Bishop, you can come on over then if you want. Go here. Don't swim. Go ahead and come on over here and you can take care of the kid. Alright. Yeah, I know we're in a group. This is not going to be a long-lasting group, so I hate to tell you, buddy, you're about to leave. Um, put the baby down. Put the baby down. Alright. Alright, I guess nothing can happen because you got him trapped. And Zenj, put down Derek. And let's see if we can get this done. Alright, go ahead and adjust his trait chips. And then Bishop, come pick up the kid. Alright, pick up Derek and then you can go home. <laughs> this game it cracks me up. Alright. Let's give him fear of humans and then we can get him get him on on sale. How can they how can they have that green stuff coming out of them if they're um <laughs> they're plum butts? Alright, let's go over here and let's sell the plum bot. Well sell plum bot. Sell Zinge. No, Zinge, put him down. Uh, Zinj, don't, don't take my kid in there. I'll be a little bit upset. All right, so you got to put the kid back down. No, oh, you <laughs> you would. This is your little ploy to actually stick around. Oh, it's because I made you a nanny. That's what it is. Put the plum or put the baby back down. Cause Bishop is here. To, you've done his job. <laughs> now let him do it. Ah. Uh. All right, Derek, hold on. He, he's coming. All right, sell your plumbot. Sell Zinj. <laughs> I mean, he's doing his job. He's doing something good, but I need him out of here. All right, Bishop, when you get him, I'm going to send you home. No, 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 no. Where are you going? Where are you going? Lord, I have no idea where they're going. All right, you guys go home. I will find where Luke went to. He's exhausted. Oh, man. All right, fine. What happened? Did you get bumped out of here or something? I have no idea what just happened. 
I know you're exhausted, so let's get you upstairs and go to bed. You're not going to go swimming. Ugh, all right, fine. Singe, you live for another day. <laughs> go ahead, come on up here and recharge. Um, poor guy. Bishop. And Meredith, I didn't even tell you what to do. I wanted you to actually meet people, but no. <laughs> I didn't tell you anything. Uh, let's see, how was your performance today? Uh, it's actually been pretty good. And you're making 23 an hour. Well, you go ahead. That is some nasty rain. <clears throat> okay, Luke, it's time to dream. <laughs> Get in here. Uh, let's see. <laughs> Just do it. Just do it. Are you hungry or anything? Nah, your bladder. We'll, we'll dream of rushing water. And then that way it'll take care of that. So you don't have to get up and go to the bathroom. Although I should get you um, still bladder. So let's dream of rushing water. I know we've done it before, but we'll do it again. We'll just keep doing it when we need to. All right. Do this quickly. I really don't need you to stay up that late. What she needs to do is um, make potions, but all that stuff is back in Moonlight Falls. That's the problem. We need to go back home and get some stuff done. We will, but not right now. All right. Can you go in there with the kid? Oh, I guess you can. All right, so that's fine. I learned something, too. Um, let's put the baby. Oh, the baby's hungry. So, Bishop, let's do this. Feed him. Let's see, give him a bottle. Let's go ahead and play with him. Um, change his diaper. Let's go ahead and just change him completely. Snuggle. Um, play with him. Then you put him in the crib. Sanj, <laughs> you drove me nuts. Uh, see, I wish um, I wish Derek could do this this fast. It would be nice. Well, he's going fast enough. I'll let him get up. Um, I'm not gonna let him just completely fill his energy bar. He'll get up after a little while. Um, so he and Meredith will be on the same level. Cause she'll be home soon. She's hungry. Hopefully they feed her, but I doubt they will. So we'll go ahead, go ahead and get her something to eat when she gets home. I keep forgetting. I want to go to the other side. It's not over there. And all right, that's good. It's done. Fine, fine. Oh, <laughs> you need to go ahead and maintain yourself. Um, oh, that's right. You have to do that first. All right, go ahead and when you get done, do yourself tune up, and you should be fine. There shouldn't be anything else for you to worry about. What is this? Soothing scenery? Oh, okay, I didn't know you got that mood. How much is it worth? Fifteen. Not too bad. Uh, Friedrich Rama and Kel Gwen are going steady. Well, let's see. She's pretty much at halfway point. He's not there yet. So, Luke, just keep on going. Oh, wrong way. <laughs> My fault. I don't even know what I chose. Ride barrel over waterfall, probably. <laughs> yeah, that's not good. All right. Take care of this. He's going to age up soon enough, probably about five hours. So I don't want to travel until that's done. But I think what we're going to do is we're going to actually just kind of wrap up her first day. Um, and we'll definitely start heading back to Moonlight Falls. See what we've got back there because I'm sure there's a bunch of stuff we can do. I want to get the trendsetter statue done. Um, her lifetime wish should be wrapping up pretty quick. And his is already done. So and it's kind of like... Might as well get hers finished. Are you coming out of here yet? No, not yet. Okay. All right. Man, just looks ugly. <laughs> it's just, it's hard to look at, especially when you know what it's supposed to look like. It's just bad. I, I like it. I mean, I like the whole, um, the different changes here for it, but eh, it'd be nice to actually see it back <laughs> the way it should be. She made 175 today. Um... Don't really need it, but I'm glad you did. Okay, Luke. I think you guys are... Yeah, she's actually a little bit better than you are. Let's do this. All right, go ahead and come on up. Your bladder feels less full. Oh, yeah, less... Uh, feels totally empty. It is totally empty. Let's get you and Zenj back over here yet again. Go here with this crazy robot. Plumbot. <laughs> whatever his name is. Zenj. Oh, you want to you wanna swim too. That must be your, your favorite pastime. What is that? Absorbing sunlight? Oh, yeah, that's right. You're solar-powered. I don't think I even made Bishop solar-powered, to be honest with you. Um, yeah, I did. Yeah, I did. So 
that's good. At least, you know, when they're out, they don't have to worry about running that, um, that battery down. Come on. Yeah, I know it's my time, but I want to at least get this done. That's my, my goal was to actually make sure he is not still level one <laughs> after this many episodes. He shouldn't be. He should be actually moving up. So we're going until we have to, you know, get this done. All right. She's actually going to eat, so I know she's fine. Um, that's fine. Okay. I was going to look at the sunset. <laughs> Yuck. It's not looking good. Um, yeah, it's not good at all. You notice how smooth it's running, and of course, if you looked, all my settings are on high. Um, if you guys are having an issue with it, you might want to check to see if The Sims 3 is actually recognizing your graphics card, because I did that. I found out that it didn't even know which graphics card I had. It thought I was using something different, and um, it makes a huge difference in your game. So there's a whole thread site. You can just look it up on um, compatible graphics, graphics card for The Sims 3, and I can't remember... It's on the Simstery forum, but it's there, and I did it. it made a huge difference. Um, I can play this game on all my higher settings, and it's pretty good. Do we want to sell it for three thousand nine hundred forty-eight? You bet we do. Sorry. Come on over here, buddy. I know you're gonna be upset. You're gonna give us a sad wave, but we gotta go. <laughs> we gotta get out of here. Stop stomping your feet. Let's go. Oh man, he doesn't want to go. Poor guy. All right. I just want to see how far we get. I hate when they won't do this. All right. We're waiting on you. And we'll see the sad little wave. I hate it. Because he was probably a good little robot. Say goodbye. <laughs> it's just so sad. Oh, we're getting ready to change into a werewolf. All right. So what do we do? We went from level 1 to level 4. <laughs> We're almost at a level 5. So, I told you it wasn't going to take much. Alright, go ahead and change and see who passes out. Uh, it's about to happen any second. And then we're going to go ahead and actually see what we have here. Alright, there you go. <laughs> well, I can't travel anyway, so I'm okay. We have to actually stick around until he changes back in the morning. The thing is, if you travel back while they're a werewolf, their voice gets stuck. And so you'll come back and their voice will be all the way on the lowest, just like the regular werewolf, and it's awful. You have to pop them in, change their whole voice again. Plus, I was trying to wait for um, Derek to age up. I wanted to actually see what kind of hair he's going to get. All right, what do we got? Um, I'm going to buy these processors, even though we can get them anytime we want. I'm going to buy these things so I don't have to make them all the time. Uh, let's see. Get the large, because it's hard to get those. You know, we've got so much money. I'm going to spend some money. I am. Otherwise, what are you going to do with it? It's just going to sit there. And I'm going to buy everything that's here. Except for the books. And I'll show you something. Okay, so we bought all those. We got everything. Alright, now try to buy again. Let's see what's there. Because sometimes it'll, once you actually buy them out or clean them out, they'll restock with new things just instantly. So, let's see what we get. Alright. Come on. <laughs> I see. We get new stuff. So this is one way to actually, if you've got the money, that's the way you do it. All right. <laughs> we'll have plenty. See, we got these things. Would have not probably had them before. And, yeah, we're spending money. All right. One more time. See what else we can come up with. I mean, we got, like I said, more money than we know what to do with. And I don't have any other things to do. With. We're not traveling. We're not doing any of that. So... As far as I'm, as far as I can tell, this is it. All right, buy all this stuff, and I don't have to sit there and keep making it. Um, not that I won't, but it's just one way to do it. Okay, and <laughs> one more time. <laughs> just why not? I'm waiting on Derek. That's the thing. If Derek will age up, life will be good. Is somebody what, picking him up? No, not yet. All right, we'll wait till he gets picked up, and then we'll actually see what he gets. Okay, last one. And then we can go make a plumb bot, and we can probably get something really good. All right, let's see. All right, we're good. Buddy, why don't you go ahead and go on home? Oh, yeah, you're going to have to hop. All right, so, uh, Adam, 
Where you at? You're at the east. Oh, you're a stargazer. Okay. All right. So we got some new people working with um, with Meredith. That's pretty cool. Luke. Oh, I'm sorry. I should have been reading these. All right. So he's conferred the new title of Soldering Wiz by the Oasis Landing Town Council. Um, he makes more than 60 a week. These were his lower pro um, promotions. And he's so close. I just wanted to make something else and be done with it. But we'll have to wait. All right, go ahead and get on up here. Meredith, why are you still up? <laughs> I have no idea. Uh, let's go ahead and get you... Mm. Oh, you're fine, actually. Why don't you come up here and play with her? And then that way you guys can actually do this. All right, wait. Is it the kid? All right, somebody's actually got the kid. All right. Nope. Who is taking care of the baby? Nobody. Um, maybe you're going to do it. I don't know. Somebody was going to do it. Okay, good. All right, so since I didn't make him do it, that means it's about to happen. So that's all I was really waiting on. And we can just go ahead and have this birthday and be done with it. And then I think what we're going to do is when we come back, um, I'll probably let them go to bed and just um, do that off camera. Just let them go off to bed, get up in the morning, change him back into human form, and then take him back home. And then that way we can work on some of the things. I mean, we've seen dystopia, and uh, it's not anything great. So, it's, I mean, it's it's interesting, but I'd rather see the regular one. And, um, okay, what do we want for him? Um, oh, we don't need to choose yet. All right, you got his mom's hair color. All right, so you are you're a witch and you got your mom's hair color. Okay, very nice. <laughs> you ought to actually play around with your kid a little bit. I mean, you know, be a good dad. Uh, let's go ahead and snuggle with him. And let's see. Is he hungry? No, he needs social. So he does need you to come over and be a good guy. <laughs> go ahead and um, why don't you teach him to walk for right now? <laughs> You're going to sit down and watch TV, play games. All right. And where do you think he is? Of course. <laughs> There's never any doubt. When in doubt, he's in the pool. All right, guys. I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up here. When we come back, we're actually going to be in Moonlight Falls. I'm going to actually take him out of here. I'm just going to let them get through the night, and then we'll go back home. He probably won't finish teaching him how to walk, but he'll get it started. Um, I don't think he's got family-oriented, does he? Yeah, he does. So he'll actually go pretty fast. So um, we'll let him just work on this. Hopefully he can get it done. If he can, great. If not, we'll finish it up when we get back home. Um, and then we will start working on the statues and do other things that we have to do. Did we get the lottery ticket and all that? Yeah. So we're ready to play the lottery when we get home. And uh, we'll actually have a lot more money. So not like we need it, but we got it. So, guys, thank you so much for watching. And I will see you next time.